So a little while ago on my community tab, I found this picture off of Pinterest showing off a collage of really popular cartoon goth girls. Out of any of them, I picked four of them that I would hang out with. Raven and Jinx from Teen Titans, Creepella Creepy Creature from Growing Up Creepy, and Lucy Loud from The Loud House. However, when I was looking through to see a collage of cartoon goth girls, not just the one I put up on that post, but other images as well, there was always one character that always stood out as a goth girl, but is not really labeled as one. And I don't think other people have really talked about it. And that character is none other than Violet Parr from The Incredibles. The point I'm trying to make with this video is, is Violet Parr secretly a goth girl when she's not disguised as a superhero. In this snippet from the Valette essay video, hosted by Sarah Val herself, she talks about how she got the role of Violet and discovering the character's personality and the voice. I didn't know if I could be a superhero. I didn't know if I could act, and I certainly didn't know if I could act like a superhero. We can do it again if you want. So Pixar sent me this package of drawings of all the characters and they were in their superhero uniforms and they looked very sleek and very can-do and capable and I really didn't know if I could pull that off. And then I come to this one drawing of Violet and all of her classmates at her high school and it is just one shiny happy teenager after another. They look polite and well-mannered and upbeat. And then I notice Violet and she's wearing these baggy dark clothes and she has her hands in her pockets and she's kind of hiding behind her hair and that's when I know that kid I can be that kid the gloomy sarcastic teenager who you know just is so uncomfortable and in her shell all the time especially at school like I can fake that. Given that Sarah Bell herself actually says that she's able to pull off that kind of attitude it kind of makes sense as to why Violet could be a goth girl even if people don't label her as one. Take, for example, the dinner scene. The first time we hear Violet Parr talking in a gloomy voice is this snippet here when Helen asks how her day was. <clears throat> so, how about you, Vi? How was school? Nothing to report. You've hardly touched your food. I'm not hungry for meatloaf. So, is it possible that Violet Parr actually is a goth girl, or is she just a regular girl pretending to be gothic? Or, in some cases, emo? Personally, I'd say yes. I personally think she is a goth girl to some extent, given her attitude. But what do you guys think? Do you think she's a goth girl or not?